was a friendly but naive king who wed a very nasty queen. The king was loved, but the queen was feared. Hey, what's up, everyone? Welcome back to another episode of Nema Seek. And today we're going to talk about some information that I was able to dig out of the IMDb page. As you guys know from our Venom vlog channel that we do on our main channel, where we follow the Venom movies, you know, starting with the first one, and now we're nearing uh, episode 600. And I was like, you know, I really have a lot of fun following these movies and looking for information and going on IMDb and things like that and trying to, you know, make connections and, and figure things out and deduce things, uh, not to spoil stuff, but just to, you know, find things to talk about. I just like digging for, you know, potential things that might happen in the movie. And again, not for the sake of spoiling anything, um, but just for the sake of discussing things and discussing if they might be possible. And we've had this tactic that we've used. Uh, tactic is probably a too of extreme of a word. But just something I do sometimes on the Venom vlog where we'll go into the IMDb page and we'll look into the um, other departments like art department and uh, production, editing, things like that. And, and we'll usually hang out in the stunt section and we try to see who is doing stunts in these movies. And that's what I want to do for Resident Evil. I was like, you know, one thing a lot of people do when they work in stunts and when they work in, you know, playing doubles or stand-ins and stuff they try to update their IMDb pages quickly because they might wrap at a certain point, uh, you know, earlier and they will need to find their next job. So whereas actors can hold out and not announce they're officially in something or not update on the IMDb, their agent and stuff can still let studios know what they're working on and get them information, you know, and get their information out there. So that way they don't have to update their IMDb if they need to keep their role a secret. But stunts and performers like that, sometimes they don't have to do that because they want to just update their accounts. And so you get, sometimes we find some gems in there. We found out someone was going to be a stunt double for Melora Walters in the first uh, Venom movie. And turns out Melora Walters was in the first Venom movie. And we were the ones who kind of broke that story. But, um, you know, not not no one else really talked about it. But since I'm a fan of Melora Walters, when I saw her name, I got very excited. I was like, yay. I love her and I was glad to see her in the Venom movie. So that's what I did here. I went through the stunts uh, area to see who might be doing stunts in this new uh, you know, Resident Evil movie. And I did actually come across uh, a person named AJ Rizzi. And I think that's how you say his last name. Uh, maybe it's Rizzi, it could be Rizzi. Um, so I apologize if I'm getting that wrong, a a AJ. But um, AJ is listed as a stunt double for a couple different things, doing stunts in, in, uh, for a couple different characters. Um, but not really any of them are majorly named except for one. And that is a character that as of right now, they have not announced is in the movie. So when I looked at AJ's resume, I saw, you know, some that he's done stunts in other movies. He has a pretty good background in stunts. And uh, I was like, oh, okay, who's this guy? Who's he playing? Uh, who's he the stunt double for in Resident Evil? And it turns out he's a stunt double for Ben Bertolucci, uh, which is great because that's like a... a, a third tier, fourth tier um, character in the Resident Evil 2 video game. In the original video game, he and in the remake, actually, he just pretty much exists in a jail cell. He's a reporter that was trying to dig up dirt on the corrupt police chief, Chief Irons, and, uh, and then ended up getting locked into the jail. I think in the original Resident Evil 2 game, he locked himself in the jail because he was just like, oh, I'll just, I'll be safe here um, until the zombie thing blows over and the cops will protect me. He had no idea that the, the cops were all wiped out by the zombies and that he was locked down there and he was probably going to starve to death. He had no idea until he met Leon because he saw Leon. He's like, hey, do you guys clear everything out up there? And Leon's like, no, everyone's dead. Uh, but in the new one, he was actually digging up dirt on Chief Irons, which he kind of was in the old one too, but he didn't really spill the beans on that like fully. Um, but in the new one, he's trying to dig up dirt on Chief Iron. So Ben Bertolucci is a character from the video game that has not been announced yet for the movie, but he has someone who's playing his stunt double uh, for the movie. So to me, I'm like, it's not 100% confirmation, of course, but in the past, in, in the Venom vlog, every time we've done one of these, which has been two or three times, we've that information has been correct each and every time. And in fact, sometimes I'll make a video on it and then someone, an agent or someone will go in and change the IMDb. But luckily we have screenshots, you know, so I'll have the screenshot up there showing you that AJ actually is playing Ben Bertolucci according to the current update as of filming this video. Again, that could change because after this, if this video actually gets seen by people, they'll be like, oh my God, we got to cover that up. Uh, but I feel like typically if that was really top secret information, um, it, you know, they wouldn't have put it up there. You know, they wouldn't have allowed it to go up or whatever. Hello? 
Hey. I don't believe it. A real human. <laughs> Hello, human. You've been here long? Long enough. Are we the last ones alive? No. No, there's a few of us. Huh. That's good news, I guess. Yeah. That's, of course, Irons sent you. Irons? You mean Chief Irons? Is he still around? Who cares? Hopefully he's somebody's dinner by now. What do you mean by that? He's the bastard that locked me in here. I'm sure he had a good reason. He did. I was about to blow the whistle on his dirty ass. I'd have done the same thing to him, I guess. Hey, I'll make you a deal. Unlock this cell and I'll give you this. There's no other way out of that parking garage. Believe me. Sorry, I can't do that. I have to talk to the chief first. Look, we're both prisoners in this station. So either we play nice and help each other out. Shit, it's coming. What? What's coming? Come on, come on, don't be an asshole. Hey, you need this. And I don't think it's a major thing, but knowing Ben is in this movie is just kind of neat. Uh, obviously, that might go into the Resident Evil 2 angle where he's you know been captured by the police and then the zombie outbreak happens and now he's stuck. But he has information, so he's trying to trade it with Leon and Ada to get out. And speaking of Ada, we found out that she's officially in the movie now, along with Richard Aiken. So the next video, I'm going to talk about Richard Aiken, and then probably the video or two after that, we'll talk about Ada a little bit. But this was just a little bit of news that I wanted to cover. So you guys let me know what you think. You know, are you excited, or would you be excited to see Ben? Like, again, we don't know for sure this means he's in it, but it, he's probably in it. If someone's listing themselves as a stunt double for a character, typically it's that's going to be the case. So... What do you think of AJ Rizzi or uh, Rizzi or what, however you pronounce your last name? AJ, I'm so sorry if I'm butchering that. Um, you know, but AJ, it's awesome to see that you're going to be part of the stunt team, and they have a, another you know great list of stunt uh, performers here. I was looking at some of their work, so maybe at some point we'll make a video when they get more people added in. We'll do a video focusing on the stunt team and talk a little bit about them, kind of like how we did with uh, Venom on the Venom vlog uh, channel. So, uh, so yeah, that'll be a fun video we can make in the future. But for now, I just wanted to focus on AJ here and the fact that he might be playing Ben Bertolucci's stunt double, which is great because then it makes me wonder, okay, who's Ben Bertolucci then? Who's playing him in the in the movie? So uh, I'll be curious to see that and I want to hear what you guys think. So let me know, Ben Bertolucci, he made it, I guess, possibly into this movie. It seems like he did. So what are your thoughts on that? Let me know in the comments below. And as always, we'll continue our conversation down there. Thanks so much for watching the show. As always, like, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and I'll see you in the future. Peace.